Well, Ian, let me tell you, uh, the 90-year-old 15-story building you see behind me here is joining a downtown Birmingham Hotel Renaissance. Now, a Birmingham Hotel developer recently bought the, the former Chamber of Commerce building here on First Avenue North. Jim Lewis plans to spend about $20 million to turn it into a 96-room hotel. He is the same man who helped give the historical Redmond Hotel new life just four blocks away. Now, those two projects join a growing downtown Birmingham Hotel reinvestment. Just a block away, you have the finished Elyton Hotel, future Fearfield Inn and Suites, and the Brown Marks Building Project. Today, the city's budget and finance committee approved lending Lewis two and a half million dollars in community block grant money. The full city council still needs to sign off on the deal. It's a beautiful building. It's uh, perhaps the most uh, protected historical building uh, that's still vacant uh, in downtown Birmingham in that it's got uh, the original architect's offices are virtually intact from almost 100 years ago. Now, Lewis says the project will take about two years to complete. When it opens, there's a chance there could be a rooftop restaurant and bar just like on the Redmond Hotel. But he says that part of the plan is still being worked out. Reporting live in downtown Birmingham, John Papke, WBTM 13.